seems to be age defying. Full disclosure, we've been talking a lot about the ladies, but the men in the TAM fam, they are age defying in the audience, in the commercial break, getting it the whole time in the show. That's how you stay young. Listen, getting older doesn't mean getting old. Something my next guests, Darcy and Stacy Silva, know well. The twins rose to fame on the TLC hit show 90 Day Fiance before the 90 Days. The show originally focused on Darcy's love life, but what fans really couldn't get enough of were their relationship, the sisters' relationship. So it was no surprise that their spinoff, Darcy and Stacy, became an overnight success. Millions of fans tuning in to see the twins navigate the ups and downs of love, of family, of life, and clothing line that they all were celebrating as well. A clothing line that's been worn by Nicki Minaj, Demi Lovato, Jessica Alba, just to name a few, and their fourth season premiered. Take a look feel like a bride. My first wedding was a quarantine wedding. So this time around, I want our wedding to be like a fairy tale. Wedding cakes can go $9,000, $11,000. I don't know, so much money. Time's ticking. She wants a nice wedding and it costs money. You gotta get a job. He needs to start contributing. If he doesn't help out, I don't know where that leaves us. Darcy and Stacy Silva join us now from Miami. Welcome to the TAM fam. Hi. Hi, everybody. Thank you, Thank you. you so much. Thank you so, so much for joining us. OK, here we go. A lot of drama to talk about. A lot. First of all, congratulations on your show. Thank Millions you. of people tuning in. One of the, we, this show is about age defying. One of the most talked about things when it comes to the two of you, cosmetic surgery. And you've been very open about how you view aging. Darcy, I'll start with you. How do you view aging? Are you trying, as the song say, turn back the hands of time? What's going on here? I mean, Stacey and I, you know, we're 48 now, and age is inevitable. But I feel for us, we are very young spirited and kind of have this youthful glow about us. We've always kind of been the way. That's probably why we've always been with, you know, dated and married younger guys. But, um, <laughs> I just think it's a part of us, it's in our DNA, and I definitely want to try to defy it the best way we know how, you know, medically, with like, you know, uh, cosmetic stuff, and other things that I feel like, it's also your mindset too. I think yeah. if you stay positive, you know, your inner side can change and uplift yourself and keep that glow. Stacy, you have, you both have had these twin surgeries. You went to Turkey for twin transformation. And again, I, I don't normally ask people about their cosmetic surgery, but you talk about it on your show. It is a part of your journey. So please, Tam Fam, don't think that I'm going through their medical records. You have been open. <laughs> Darcy and I, uh, we wanted to go to Turkey together. We've done our research. We've had surgery. We've been very open about that. We're very authentic with what we do. We want to be transparent. Um, we're very happy with, with our results. We're 48. And, what you know, lift we, everything we up. just wanted to lift everything back up. Um, for us, we did the nose, we did a lip lift, buckle fat um, removal, buckle fat removal um, a breast lift, and some lipo. So we're very happy with the results. It's just something that we wanted to experience together. And for us, it was more about the, the inner, the inner journey. When you looked in the mirror, you said, you know what? I feel like the outside matches how I feel on the inside. Take me through that. Yes. Yeah, absolutely. After, you know, we had the healing, it was like, you know, a few weeks to at least kind of get the results to see how we were going to feel. But I, I definitely feel like it was the best thing that we chose for us. Um, our kids were um, very pleasantly surprised and happy. They actually were <laughs> like, kind of cheered us on a little bit. And they're like, wow, you actually look better. I could tell because you're, you know, holding yourself better. And you, you have this like, more positive attitude about, you know, who you are and stuff like that. So I definitely feel like the surgeries match the inside as well. You know, of course, as I said, everybody has an opinion, social media. Yeah. You're not afraid to confront some of these things. Uh, you told the New York Post that we might get a lot of hate, but people actually message us all the time, like, where can I go? What do you recommend? So a lot of people call and want the same things that you've done. I think they see our journey. We're very authentic. We're very real. Um, you know, Stacy and I don't hide anything. We're very open and very honest open. on camera about everything in our life, relationships, what we have done, you know, just 
in life and we don't have any shame in that. I feel like it was the best decision for us. When we come back, the question people keep asking, will you continue to have surgery? And does love in your life keep you young? Stacy's dream wedding and how Darcy is now back in the dating game next. This restaurant really offers an experience. So I took the liberty to order your food. Oh. It's a little strange that Mike's ordering for me without asking me what I wanted. But at the same time, it's a little bit of a breath of fresh air because he's taking charge. And the guys that I used to date never did that for me. Welcome back to AmFam. That was a clip from my guests Darcy and Stacey Silva's hit TV, reality TV show on TLC, Darcy and Stacey. Stacey, a lot of people wonder if dating young er makes basically your guy is 17 years younger than you. Has yes, that kept right. you younger? Absolutely. I definitely feel like Florian has brought out the best in me. We're soulmates, best friends, but there's just some something about our dynamic together. Um, I haven't always been with younger guys, but for me, it just felt right. I have to tell you, because first of all, it's fascinating, the whole concept of, of how love is explored on the show. But I did go out once with a much younger guy, and I remember a song came on the radio, and he said, oh, it came out, it was a DJ, and he said, oh, I used to jam in middle school on that. And I was like, I was oh in college. <laughs> I was in college at that time. So I was shook on the concept of ever dating much younger. <laughs> Darcy, you have teenagers, you got two daughters, Aniko is 18, Aspen is 16. Um, for you, you're now dating. It, with, with teenagers in the house, what do they think of your, your dating life, and especially you putting it out there on t TV? Yeah, I mean, the girls are amazing. You know, I really raised them right. They have good head on their shoulders, and they just want to see me happy. You know, they're, they, they know I've always kind of been attracted to you a little bit younger, and you know, as long as they treat me right, that's all they care about. So let me ask you this. Uh, people always want to know, are you done with age-defying surgery? Do you want more? Are you done with this? I think, you know, over time, it's just gonna... We love treatments. Yeah. And we like to do actually a lot of non-invasive treatments mm -hmm. as well. Um, there's, like, lasers, lasers and things you could do. Serums, creams. Yeah. We've had threads done. It's like a non-invasive facelift. Never say never. Facelift. <laughs> never say you know, never. We love our threads. All right, well, we'll be watching the love, the drama, and, of course... If you do the surgery, we'll know about that too. So thank you so much exactly. for joining yeah. us. Congratulations on the thank show you. and the marriage and the wedding and the kids. Darcy and Stacey, you can catch a new season of their show, Darcy and Stacey on TLC.